Well, the Regional Transportation Authority is running short of drivers and it's now offering bonuses to attract new drivers. The RTA says it's currently about 40 drivers short of what it needs. Our Seth Kovar has been looking into the shortage and this new incentive program, and he says it sounds like it's working. Seth? Yeah, Lee, it does. CCRTA announced the bonuses a couple of weeks ago, and already the next driver training class is full. Leadership tells me it's been many years since that many people have signed up, and they hope the potential drivers just keep on coming. Mm, I don't think so. No. Yeah, I don't think we are. The Gonzalez family visiting Corpus Christi this week doesn't plan to use the bus. They've got whatever this thing is. This is the first time riding a, this kind of bicycle also, yeah. we just wanted to try it. For thousands of other people, city buses are the way to get around. But right now, the Corpus Christi Regional Transportation Authority is short dozens of drivers. We have a critical need. Drivers are working lots of overtime, and so far they've been able to cover all routes. But they could use some breathing room. We balance it every day, trying to make all the numbers work. It would be nice to be able to get a few more operators here on board, and thus the reason for the bonus program we, we launched uh, a couple of weeks ago. 53 people have signed up for the next training class. Once they pass and hit the road, they'll get those bonuses that range from $300 all the way to $2,500. A lot of it depends on whether or not you have your commercial driver's license, a CDL. It's something this man's working towards, but to drive a big rig, not a bus. No, bus, I'm, not a, I'm not a people person. <laughs> the RTA says that dealing with people is an important part of the job, along with good driving skills, of course. Handling a bus on busy streets isn't for everyone, but the bonuses are proving to be a good motivator. Driving a bus, uh, I guess, it's yeah. It's bad, yeah, we can do it. Yeah, I think uh, if it comes down to it, you know, everybody has got a, needs a transportation to go somewhere. So. Not having a CDL is not a deal breaker. The RTA will actually help you earn that license, and they'll actually do it for free. Lee? All right, that sounds like a pretty good deal. Now, for more information about becoming an RTA driver, just look for this story on ChrisTV.com.